lightning effects on this gun. So good. Look at that. Oh yeah, he doesn't have any more dialogue. We're gonna leave. Oh! Wait, how the fuck are we here already? Because that previous room was... Okay, yeah, I mean, I guess it makes sense. Because in the other game, other game, we went, like, all the way around. Yeah, that, that's GLaDOS's chamber right there. I am so chill. <laughs> it's because, like, my chair, like, you can see the back of it right there. Um, it has a fairly low, like, headrest. So I have to lean back if I want to rest my head on it. Ugh. Break the glass. Bang bang. No. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over it. She's off. All fine. On we go. No no no. You said we're not going in there. I don't want to go in there. You're not gonna say anything. You're just gonna stare at me. New emotes from uh, Brown Man. Nice. <clears throat> yeah, I haven't um, managed to check out Brown Man in a long time. All right, we're gonna be super quiet, guys. Can't wake up Glados because she's a, a raging cunt. All right, so we're just gonna sneak on by. Go this way. No. Holy shit, that is a lot of emotes. <laughs> that meme emote is awesome. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna clip now we can't clip you the bush. The bush the bush is solid. Solid bush. She is. <laughs> there she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Right? Like a proper maniac. Right? Do you, know who ended up, uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not going to believe this. A human. I know. Yeah. I know. I wouldn't have believed yeah. either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch me. She is. That's her face. Let's just keep going this way. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're home free. Ah, we did it. Down these stairs. Jump! It's actually, look at it. That is quite a that's quite a distance, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. You know what? Uh, right. Go ahead and jump. You've got you've got braces on your legs, so I do. you're all set. I don't even have legs. No braces on your arms, though. So you're going to have to rely on the old human strength to keep a grip on the device and, by extension, me. So do do really make sure you keep a grip on me. Also, a note: no braces on your spine either. So so don't land on that. Um, mm -hmm. Or your head: no braces there. Mm -hmm. That could that so could split just like a melon from this height. <laughs> um, so do definitely focus on landing with your legs. Mm -hmm. Now that that was that was this game. Have you been working out? Because I'll be honest, there's no uh, evidence on yeah. it. You know, I'm not what? I'm not like just a plastic cup. Uh, we will be landing with some force. So a uh, bit of bit of grip. Just using grip. Classic grip. Right, let's go. Jump! What's the worst that could happen? We oh. die. Oh, I just thought about the worst thing that could happen. Now. Oh, yeah. I just thought of something even worse. Better plan, a new plan. No imagining of any potential outcomes whatsoever. Okay, just just jump. Just jump into the into the abyss and, and see what happens. Oh, it's still there. It's still in my head. There we jumped. 
Uh, you mean grammar with an A? <laughs> what about that over there? Let's let's jump onto those stairs. Those, those look safe. Ah! Oh, still right, held. Even still move. being held. You that's a great job. Yeah. You've applied the grip. We're all fine. That's tremendous. Got a fucking iron grip. You're watching a lot of old achievement hunters. Ah! I just sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I just done it again. <laughs> right. Let me get out of here. This. Is God damn it. Is the main breaker room. That's Let's go the in. Breaker? All right. Oh yeah, look at all the breakers. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't even, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something that doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing, all right? But don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. They don't say anything. anything. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. No. Uh, tell you what, plug oh, wow. me in and I'll turn the lights on. <clears throat> Didn't look down, he looked at my dick. Let there be light. That's uh, God. It's quoting God. Oh, look at that! Turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. It's gonna no. move up and hit all the switches. Escape pod, escape pod. It's, it's moving up. Yeah. Okay. Okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. This should slow it down. No, makes it go faster. Uh oh. Power up and everything. Okay, don't panic! Alright, stop panicking. Uh, I, can, I can still stop this. Um, uh, oh, there's a, there's uh, a pass. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just hack it. Not a problem. Uh, a, 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 um, A. Okay. A, 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 C. No. Wait, did I do B? Do you have a pen? Start writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't, okay, 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 listen. All right, new plan. Act natural, act natural. We've done nothing wrong. Hello! Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? Pretty well. I've been really busy being dead. <clears throat> you know, after you murdered me. You did what? Uh... Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh no, 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 no! Yeah. Okay, look. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. <laughs> but I think we can Ooh, put our differences behind up. us. For science. You monster. Yeah, I say, though, it's the mega since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. The cake! It's cake. It's cake, isn't it? We're gonna get cake. Now, what would GLaDOS do if I died during that? Here we are. The incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Yeah. What happens if I jump in the fire? Okay, we just die. Good to know. Here we are. The yes. incinerator room. Yes. Be careful not to trip over any yes. parts of me Oops. that didn't get completely burned when yes. you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once should we be. find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Okay. Can you move this? Lettos? Hello? Roll credits when you jumped in. Oh, the turret! 
Can I save one of these things? Which one are they coming out of? This one? That one? Or was that it? Is there no more? Everyone looks so cool. Device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Or we could just do this for days and days and days on end. Look at this. What cool is this? I can watch myself run. Or we could go like that and make it more interesting. Uh huh? Yeah. How cool is that? That's pretty neat, right? That's not thingy. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Oh, fantastic. Hey, Jaden, how's it going? Doing some good old uh, Portal 2 here. Here, let me get that for you. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. Oh, fantastic. Able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm Helpful. happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. Why can't I go through? More or less. I don't have the actuarial okay. tables in front of me. Doing alright. Been better. Been worse. We're playing one of my absolute favorite games of all time, though. So, definitely towards the better end right now. Test number 19. Damn. I'll just move that out of the way for you. This place really is a wreck. <coughs> but the important thing is you're back. With me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing. For the rest of your life. After that, who knows. I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. <gasps> Ow. <laughs> Please remain calm. done the infinite fall at least once, right? Uh, one of my favorite um, puzzles is from the first one, where you got like that platform and you gotta get on top of it, and the only way to do that is to get a portal on top, and a portal underneath, and you gotta crouch through. So you basically like portal through it. Super awesome. Uh, Oodle... Oodle on Ardo... Oodle on Ardo is awesome. Hello! <laughs> How are you? I'm feeling mildly sick right now, but playing some Portal Sorry 2. About the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks oh, yeah. for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Is this water fatal? No, just water. Ooh, can we... Laser that? I 
I want a laser thingy. Wow, it's going right through the camera. Look at that. That that that's a pretty pretty burly looking camera right there. Hey, thanks, man. I appreciate that. Alright, so let's actually solve the puzzle here. Oh. Oh, not yet, I lied. Now, let's actually solve the puzzle. Which one was it? That one? Yeah. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. Can I kill myself with the laser from up here? I don't think so. No, because it angles it away. Unless... No, I don't think I can. Oh no, turret friend! See, I like to think that it's just one turret constantly, like, following through the lab here. Following us as we go on. <laughs> that duck. Thermal discouragement beam. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Oh, we actually didn't even need to do that. We could have just gone through like this. one in the corner. Where? Oh. Uh... Well done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. Oh. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. <laughs> I love GLaDOS and Sass this game. So on point. <clears throat> Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Fantastic. Orphan joke number one. Okay, first things first. Get rid of that camera. That, yeah. Get what onto there. Yeah. And then we gotta power up that one too. Congratulations. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. And there's the first fat joke. Oh, nope. Okay, bye.
One moment. Okay. You're navigating these test chambers yeah. faster than I can build them. I see so that. Feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Ah, no. Come back. That makes me sad. The timing on that could not have been worse. Now we gotta wait for that to come all the way back, huh? This will give me a cube. you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. What? I think I did pretty well on that Glados. Waddle over to the elevator and we'll continue the testing. Is this the the aerial faith plate thingy or whatever it was called? These things are fun. This next test involves the Aperture Science aerial faith plate. Yes. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. <laughs> I love how much bigger everything is in this game, too. Ah. Oops, actually didn't want to go right back. Didn't want to go as soon as it hits, so... Now. Yeah. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. That is pretty interesting. Even though technically that's kind of how like air works. Well, I mean, not so much that you're getting the Let's same see air back. What the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Yeah, it's a shame you're a robot. Cause that doesn't mean a different or make a difference to you. Okay. Okay. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Oh, is that not right? No. Oh, it's a turret. Turret, bro. Alright, give me another one. 
You know, that one's a cube. Genius. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. You don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Okay, why do we have this CD? Oh! Okay, some of the garbage it was flinging probably had a radio in it, and we probably could have played it. Huh. Oh well. <clears throat> On to the next. <clears throat> As I just drip water all over myself because cap on my bottle being on all the way. <sighs> Drinking's hard. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry, I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Oh, it's a companion cube. Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. Oh well. We have warehouses wow, that full is. of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. <gasps> it's Wheatley! Take it with me. Okay, we got this. <clears throat> Alright, now we need to get it up there. Falls, the launching ship. Right, or do we need to get there first? No, oh, let's try for the higher one first. And see where we go from there. And sadly, because we whoop. Because we need to take the cube with us, we need to put the portal first and then jump. You can't shoot to where we're going. Fuck! Not enough momentum. Uh, jump? Maybe? Did that give me enough? Probably not. Yeah, I know. Did not go through the laser death. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Yep. Don't take anything with you. I think that one was about to say, I love you. They are sentient, of course. 